Hello zombies and welcome back to Santa Monica. We are outside the Empire Arms Hotels because there is a guy that we need to kill in here. Right, um, we know that this guy Boris, who's been boning this girl, um, who doesn't want to be boned anymore, uh, and is using money as a form of... Thank you. Um, Right, it's the penthouse we want to go to, so we want to go to level six. Okay, so, um, I think, ballroom, Empire Mafia key. <gasps> okay, so, right, we're here to kill, like, the dude. Can't open that one. Oh, I can't lockpick that. I'm pretty sure I can't because my lockpicking is terrible. Nine? Huh. Okay. Uh, let's go the opposite direction. Maintenance. No, oh, that's probably going to be failed as well. Okay. What's through here? I don't know what that is. Can I uncrouch? Vision of death. Oh god. Owie. Owie, owie, ow. Um. Owie. Uh, okay. So, um, yeah, I, I'm killing everyone, apparently. Um, let's crouch. Let's put our weapon away. Um, have to be very, very careful. I want to sneak up on people and eat them, I think. Like him. We can eat him without conscience. My, you're nummy. And give me a weapon. Apparently, the images at the moment are a bit screwed. Um, but okay, we can deal with that. I don't know where I'm going. Okay, that's room one. Okay, I just ate people in here. Okay, that's fine. I guess we're going this way. Maintenance? No, we're going this way. And I've got vision of death, so if I can't eat someone straight away... No, that's where I just walked into. No one there. Maintenance. Huh. Can I just... Hup. No, I want to go up. Crouch. Nope. Hup, crouch. Huh. Boxes. Yeah, there's something wrong with the graphics at the moment. Or maybe I just want to go this way. I'm going to feed on you. Nom 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 And dead and give me whatever weapon it is you're holding. Thank you. It's a knife. I collect those all the time, but I uh because I'm rubbish. That's the bathroom. Let's crouch over this way. That's just more bathroom. Let's go see what's outside the door. Shh, be very, very quiet. We're hunting watchers. Hello. 
Who the hell are you? You are the key. Do what comes natural. <laughs> oh, oh, being dragged in against my will. Hello, monsieur. Huh. Who the hell are you? I am the herald from the goddess with the message for your ears. Maniac, who let you in? Lima, put this bad dog down. Your friends hate you. They plot your death. They will betray you. Take my place. All I do for you, traitor! Are you talking to me? Never mind. I'm just gonna, like, take all this shit. I'm gonna take your shit as well. And, and all that shit. And that. You all that's left? Really? Oh, fuck you. And dead. Cool. Is that everyone? I think that might be everyone, actually. Well, that was really easy. Do, 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 do. I mean, really easy for somebody who's lost most of her health. Open it. And we're going downstairs. And I will speak to you once I've spoken to the nightclub. Well, we're going to go speak to the nightclub owner, I guess. Okay, we're back at the nightclub. Uh, dancing time. No? No dance? Dancing. Dance, dance. There. I'm a dancing. Really, really terribly. Come on, come dance with me, my minions. Oh, yeah. Oh, I've got twins appearing from nowhere. It's a double twin night. Okay, let's go talk to Venus. There you are. Finished yet? Yep. Let us enter your orifice. What? Let us enter no, your I office. I can't hear you. Let's talk in my office. Yeah, that, that's what I was saying. Your orifice. Boris. The Tsar has fallen. Is that Boris's plan? Guess we're partners then. If you only knew what I had to do over the years to keep this place open, tell you mm -hmm. what, partner. Come in every few days and I'll give you your cut. Here's tonight. I've got some money to Awesome! Make. I'll hold your share of the profits. Don't forget to drop by and scoop them up once in a while, hmm? Deal! I will turn as often as the stars, goddess. Cool. So, log, quest log. Um, problems with Boris, don't forget to visit her periodically to get your... Sh okay, so I'm a partner in a club. I guess the next thing we've got to do is... Alistair Grout, the Malkavian Primogen. His mansion's on the outskirts of town. I guess that's where we're going next. Oh yeah, and all of this is mine. Right, so we're off to Grout's mansion and we are going to get this big yellow beetle scuttling towards my destiny. We're going to Grout's mansion? Mansion? Mansion. He's over there. Oh my. Hello. Are we going to chat? What are you doing here? What are you doing here? He of the numbered name. No. Do you also seek the missing Malkavian? You should get out of here. This place is bad news. Uh, pardon me. Your mouth is making mystical mush. Okay, so shit's gone down. I wonder what my quest log is saying. He seemed a bit out of sorts. Yeah, he does, doesn't he? Just a little bit. Okay, what's around? Anything, any goodies? Anything I need to take outside the, the mansion. Um, 
I really hope this place isn't haunted like the last mansion I was in because um, that scared the living bejesus out of me. So yeah, we're gonna go in. Dun dun dun. Uh, hello? Hello? I knew that was gonna happen! Huh. What the fuck? Okay, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to up my melee whilst I'm here. No, it's C. Um, because I've got enough for this level, and the next level is 12. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be kick-ass. Okay, what's my quest log say? Something about it doesn't feel quite right. I'm gonna go with that. Definitely odd about this place. It is quite peculiar the happenings I've been made to witness for my, my natural longevity. I am thinking of one unfortunate phenomenon in particular of unique interest to my station, both as a professional and as a sufferer of this vampiric condition. Mm -hmm. It seems the stream of time has begun to erode the moorings of my chosen course of study, for the methodologies what? that gave birth to psychology are slowly disappearing. Oh. Okay. I find myself in an era that overlooks the physical component of psychological pathology time and again in favor of the sophistic practices of Freud. What? Phrenology, dactopintalism, and the rest of the old god has fallen by the wayside. Its champions all silenced in death with my unique exception. Oh, so you're a phrenologist could make my advocate. Again may be suspicious should I return to popular medical discourse 50 years after my apparent death. <sighs> no, better that I continue my studies into the psychoses in secret. One day, may I hold up my own cure as validation of the methods. I am confident mm -hmm. no cure for my condition or that of my beloved wife lies within our figurative minds what? waiting to be unlocked by the correct combination of memories recovered from our childhoods. And I'm most certain it has nothing to do with the relationship between myself, my parents, and my genitals. Sorry, Sigmund, but I choose to stay my course. In time, too, may your star fade and disappear. Yep, that's a Malkavian painting. Um, why all the laughter of a sudden? Let's climb over here. Can't get in that one. It's locked. It's locked. <laughs> what? Another unfortunate casualty to tide of time, insane asylums. I lament their loss, not only as brokerage houses for the breadth and depth of human <laughs> psychosis, but also I shall mourn the disappearance of that peculiar environment present only in an insane asylum. That palpable atmosphere of blistered brains and churning bowels, the odiferous melange of freely flowing is... bodily humours, that gently rolling cacophony of distant sobs. Very, very the weird. The mother cursing at perceived enemies and the blissful gurgling of the lobotomized. Like a newborn baby Shut up! Covering the sky. Hmm. Huh. I shall still find test subjects as surely as I find bloody sustenance in the night. Okay. But this climate, I fear, may never be ready. Okay, perception at once shapes the mind and rules over time. Time, however, erodes human perception and then in turn warps the mind. The mind is capricious, having various effects on perception, time, and mind itself with how many progress is made. Okay then. Right. Now. Okay, so there's the eye, the hourglass, and the mind. 
Things have been opened. What has been opened? I don't know what I opened. That that worries me. It's probably upstairs thinking about it. Um considering there was this ladder here. Let's go up this ladder. Owie. I'm not trying to fight, I'm trying to open up okay. Huh. Right, okay, going this way now. Going can't go in that one. Can't go in that one. Hup. Oh no, I don't want to be stuck there. I don't want to be stuck there. There. Uh this this room, maybe? You're dead. Okay. Right, running away. Okay. That's a lot of dead people. And ow, that hurts. And you appear to be stuck in the door. And um, yeah. There's, there's stairs to nowhere. That's cool. No, really, that's cool. I'm going to stay in here and wait for my blood levels to increase my health a little bit, and I'll be back in a second. Right, we're going to go through each of these doors in turn, I guess. Um, or not, as the case may be. Nope. Nope, we're not going to go in any of those doors because they're all locked. Right, I guess this door now? Okay, ready to fight someone, I assume? No, that's the main office. Okay, so I've been through there. I think I've been up there. That's the room I just come out of. And I've been up here. Okay. So which is the door? that, huh, that I unlocked. It's not that one. I'm quite confused. Um. Right, why is there a say? Perception at once shapes the minds and rules over time. These capricious are... Various effects on perception, time and mind itself with harmony progress is made. Oh god. Okay, something got opened. Something got opened. Let's... let's... Wasn't that room. Wasn't that room. I'm pretty sure it was the, the room that I went in a second ago. Come on, open, let me go through. Pretty sure it was this room. Right. Can't open that one. Can't open that one. Can't open that one. Um... Okay, I'm going to call it here. This is the start of this quest, and I'll catch you later, zombies. Bye-bye!